Hi guys, I'm, uh, this is my first video on YouTube. I'm just doing it because I didn't find any of this uh, kind. Um, I'm planning to upgrade my laptop that I just bought. Um, it's an VN7571G55BL. So it's uh, of the Acer Aspire VN7571G series. Uh, and I want to upgrade it with an uh, M.2 SSD. I've got this Transcend model, 265 giga gigabyte, and uh, the problem with this kind of laptop is that uh, you have to um, uh, n not only get the keyboard out, you also have to um, unscrew the mainboard and put the uh, SSD on the on the bottom side of the mainboard. So what we have to do is uh, at first um, it's the same like. So the first steps are the same like in the other models of this uh, Acer Aspire VN7 series. You can uh, look it up. There are some tutorials for the uh, 591 g series. You just unscrew the, um, the screws here on the bottom. So put the screws aside. And then the best way to get the clips out is just pressing somewhere at the corners. You can try to get your fingernails in there. And then you hear that the clips will get loose. So that's done. But you can see it in other tutorials, no problem. Yeah, you might have some problems getting that out, but oh yeah. Just get your fingernails between there. So now for the cables. I'm not sure if you see that, but you don't really have to see that. Um you loosen the clips. Yeah, in my case, I don't know if, if they are all the same. There are two clips that I have to loosen to get the cables of the main board uh, of the keyboard out, and then there is one that I just put out. Okay, so so these were the three cables um, that I had to loosen. I don't know if you see them. Not so important. Okay, second. So. Now this is the main board, what you see here, um, here's the, the hard drive that was uh, already put in, the SHDD, uh, here's the um, my DVD drive, and here yeah, you see some cables, uh, you have to get out uh, the cables that are attached to the main board, so our plan is to get the, uh, just lift the, the main board up a little, um, over here is the um, Wi-Fi module, um, and the uh, I don't know I, I I don't know these clips that the cables are attached to so I'm not uh, I'm not detaching these uh, these cables I just lift the mainboard up and put the uh, new SSD in there you have to loosen two um, two additional screws one at the Wi-Fi module and. Oh, I just lost it, but I think I'll find it again. And one is over here. Uh, I'm gonna show you which one. This one, it's uh, beneath uh, the sticker here. So I have to, to lift the sticker up. And then I'm um, getting there. And um, I'm screwing this screw. Okay. So screws. Ah, I found the other one again, so put them aside. Then uh, you have to get all the cables out, sorry, that are uh, attached to the main board. One is over here. Just get them out carefully. Don't mess anything up. There are some cables, of these flat cables that are just clipped to the main board. You have to get the clip up and pull the cable out. 
over here is a, a cable. I think it's from the CD, DVD drive. Get that one out. And when you have uh, pulled that one out, you can um, uh, push the, the, the drive, the DVD drive out from the, from the main board. Oh no, it's, uh, this cable was from the, from the battery, sorry. So just pull the DVD drive out so it's not in the way. Okay, is there anything more? Um, I don't see anything. Well, okay, I think we can get this cable out. I did this the last time. This is actually the second time that I opened the laptop. The first time I was just looking if I'm able to do it. Then I bought the SSD drive. And now I want to upgrade the laptop. Okay, I got this cable out here. So there are some cables. You just have to look where there are some cables attached to the mainboard and get them out. So now I've unscrewed the two screws here. One was over here at the Wi-Fi module. I'm not sure if you saw it. Yeah, there was it. Uh, here it was. Okay, I got this one out also. And now you just have to lift it up. Lift it up. So the um, USB plugs and the HDMI plugs are kind of um, clipped onto the uh, the laptop so you have to uh, push the, the plastic aside a little and then you can uh, give me a sec so now I've got it so that's what all uh, all that we have to do now I uh, can lift it up and I'm gonna get the SSD so this is the SSD, it's a um, 2280 model, so it's 8 centimeters long, 22 millimeters uh, width. And now we can insert it. Okay, give me a second. Be careful. Um, okay, which way is the question? I think. I have to look at my. Yeah, it had to be. We well, have to look. I'm. I'm not sure either how it has to be put in here. Yeah, something like this. Just put it in. Just like this. So I don't know if you see it. It's a little bit tilted away from the main board. Put it in like this, and then push it down. And then there's a place for a screw down here. Sadly, uh, there was no screw coming with my uh, SSD, so I'm not sure. I think I'm just trying to um, to use a screw from my from my case. It's kind of sad, but I don't have a choice. I'll try another one. One of the screws that were on the main board so oh, oh that's shit well I think I have to turn the laptop over so that's the way I'm gonna do it well, I'm adding a second do it like this so the screen is not getting messed up Okay. Well, I was hoping there was a clipping mechanism, but there isn't, so we need a screw for this one. Okay, that fits. It's great. So, we've got that fixed. Now we can get it down again okay make sure if you saw, I hope you saw it I'm not really uh, watching the camera I'm sorry I'm, I'm a noob I'm a YouTube noob so excuse me just trying to help you uh, 
watch the cables don't forget which cable you detached so you can put them back in have to look out that they are on top of the main board when you're done okay so i've got that everything is fixed i think um okay it kind of looks strange gotta admit that but yeah let's just try it okay if i put that back in here does it fit no doesn't kind of strange okay give me a sec oh okay so now yeah now it's in place now it's everything in place so okay just put the cables back in the flat cables you have to clip them down so get the clips up put the cable in and clip it down so this one was in here well I guess uh, you heard that upgrading it with an SSD is kind of hard so I heard it too and I was a little afraid but it's not so hard just have to be careful uh, I'm not a professional either I just opened some laptops in my life and upgraded like I don't know HDDs or something nothing special but it's, it's possible to upgrade this laptop not that hard you don't break any uh, warranties by doing that it's no problem okay um so i think i lost the screw somewhere where did i put that damn oh there it is okay so i unscrewed this one here um and i used the screw that was here for uh so it was over here the screw that i uh, got from here i used it to um fix the fixate the SSD so I don't have this now but I think this screw was not necessary I hope the main board is kind of fixed by all the plugs here so I hope that works um, of course I recommend uh, getting a screw for that one or getting an SSD that is that has a screw delivered with it so now I'm done uh, I just have to get the main uh, the keyboard back on top so that should work now. So getting the keyboard back in is the worst part, um, especially the the long cable. This really sucks. So I think I will skip this part also. Okay, I hope I did everything right. So I just clip it back together well, um, I'm not gonna clip it together I think I'll try to turn it on at first and then we'll see if it works okay what does he say he found some new hardware and we can use it. That's what he says. Let's take a look. So you say we can use it, but I don't find it now. I think it's not um, uh, partitioned yet, so maybe I just have to get the one partition on it. But it should work. Um, if not, I'm not going to upload this video, of course. I think it'll work, and I'm going to write down uh, some information in the description I think what I did in the following few minutes okay thanks for watching um, of course I'd really appreciate a thumbs up if you liked it and bye